OK, I just want to ask you uh, whether there is a little part of you that's actually happy that you could now be um, competing in European elections and whether or not you'll be standing for your new Brexit party. Oh, I'll be leading the Brexit party into those European elections, as it now looks certain they will happen. Uh, am I happy about it? No, I'm not. Actually, I've got many other things in my life I'd like to do. I thought we'd won the Brexit battle, uh, but I'm not going to, after 25 years of endeavour, uh, watch uh, British politicians roll us over. No, nope, this is the fight back, and they're going to be very surprised by what they get. And did you see Jacob Rees-Mogg's tweeted this morning saying that if a long extension yeah. leaves us stuck in the EU, we should be as difficult as possible. We could veto any increase in the budget, obstruct the putative EU army and block Mr Macron's integrationist schemes. It does sound sometimes like you're very well aligned. Well, I've been trying to do that for 20 years in the European Parliament. I've done my best, but it's very hard to stop them. Uh, we could do all of those things Jacob asks for, but only with a very different Prime Minister.